Well, Jessica, witnesses say they've never seen anything like it. That driver spinning in circles here in this intersection behind us before driving onto the sidewalk just inches from hitting innocent people. Scattering left and right, running for their lives as the driver goes berserk on the streets of Inwood. Others watching from the road in disbelief after police say a traffic stop went horribly wrong early Sunday morning. Police tell us they spotted 27 year old George Lopez driving erratically around 4 a.m., but they say when they tried to stop him at Dykeman Street and Payson Avenue, he refused to open the window or door, instead, slamming on his accelerator. Smashing into their police cruiser, then narrowly missing the officers as he reverses. Hitting another parked car, spinning a few times, and jumping the curb, speeding down the sidewalk. I mean, it was like a movie. The guy was just not taking orders. The police would, you know, he would not respond to police. He would just do whatever he wanted to do. Hitting other vehicles, he was just shaking, moving his hands up and down. It was scary. It was a little scary. I'm surprised he didn't kill anybody on the sidewalk. Police say they chased after Lopez. Oh as he continued his getaway, driving the wrong way on the Henry Hudson Parkway, going north in southbound lanes before exiting onto Mashalu Parkway in the Bronx, where they say he hit an SUV, injuring another driver and himself. And police say three officers also had minor injuries. They tell us Lopez did not have a license on him at the time and was driving under the influence of some kind of drug. He is now facing a slew of charges, including reckless driving and reckless endangerment. We're live in Inwood tonight. Rena Roy, CBS 2 News.